Christopher Boozy reveals Meg's lie to control him to slam Queen Elizabeth II's picture, Photoshop, to blow Kate's icon. Tech CEO Christopher Boozy says he's disappointed that an image posted last week to commemorate Queen Elizabeth's 97th birthday was manipulated, causing outrage. However, he eventually acknowledged that Meghan Markle influenced him into slamming her. The image of Queen Elizabeth has been photoshopped, therefore Kate's image has been ruined. The image, which shows the late monarch posing with eight of her 12 great-grandchildren at Balmoral, was taken just weeks before her death. The late monarch appeared in her element with Lady Louise Mountbatten-Windsor, James, Viscount Severn, Lena Tyndall, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, Isla Phillips, Prince Louis, Mia Tyndall, Lucas Tyndall, and Savannah Phillips. All the children are smiling sweetly as they surround the Queen, who was sitting between them on a Chesterfield sofa and wearing tartan at her beloved Aberdeenshire home. Some of the great-grandchildren were, however, missing, including the children of Montecito-based Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, the son of Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank, August, and the daughter of Princess Beatrice and Eduardo Mapelli Mozzi. Christopher Buzzi, who is understood to be a supporter of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, appeared in the Netflix documentary last year, describing the photographs as beautiful on Twitter. Calling on people to stop criticizing the photo, he said, yes, they photoshopped it, and so what? It's not easy to get the perfect photo with 10 children. It appears they took multiple shots and then edited the photo to make it perfect. I would have done the same. In a later tweet about the snap, which was shared on the official social media accounts of the Prince and Princess of Wales, he wrote, You can literally see where two sides of the sofa were spliced together, and there are pixels on the face that were not properly edited. As I stated in my original tweet, I don't see anything wrong with it, but to claim it's not photoshopped is false. It has been edited. He also added, Also, the Queen was probably exhausted and didn't want to sit through a long photo shoot. A number of respondents agreed with the assessment that image has been photoshopped. One wrote, As a photographer, I can tell that this is what we do, especially with our larger groups, combining the best. Who is complaining about this? With other users writing, I did this with the Thanksgiving family photo once. Getting a decent photo of that many children is akin to herding cats. Photoshopping was necessary. However, the post prompted some backlash with a number of Twitter users disagreeing, saying there's no evidence of Photoshop in this photo at all, which was just not true. Meanwhile, a further commentator simply said, I don't think the photo is photoshopped. A number of commentators, some of whom agreed the image had been touched up, questioned why in that case all the grandchildren had not been edited in. Some suggested that this could be because of the rift between the royal family and the Sussexes, but others pointed out that there were other children absent from the snap too, including the children of Princess Beatrice and Eugenie. Some users saying, the issue with the pic is that if they photographed the pic, they could have photoshopped the Sussex children in it. The point is, if they were photoshopping kids into the picture, then why didn't they include all of the Queen's great-grandchildren if they could do it?